Hello and welcome back. This is Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. And we're gonna try and take out these woolly mammoths here. Hopefully that doesn't take out anybody here. Ooh, pretty close. Ow. Okay. I don't want to switch that party yet. Oh crap, yeah, I gotta take this guy out because he's gonna attack the Mog party there. I don't want that right now. <sighs> yeah, all these characters right here, they could all die for all I care. I really don't care care at all about this party right here. Yep. Let's use physical attacks. Shouldn't be too hard to take these guys out. Okay, is there anybody left? Okay, there's no one left. Alright, this is the leader right here, and uh, actually... Yeah, why not? I'll use a few potions just to guarantee that I'll win this fight. Not that I'm worried at all, really. Ow. Okay, get dance going with Mog here. All right, he attacked the guy I wanted him to. Awesome. <laughs> Already dead. Awesome. Yeah. Wow, I think that's actually like a record time that I've beaten that guy and his two wolves. Okay. Secret door. All right. Save your thanks for the moogles. Yeah, well, I guess it'd help out a little bit. Yeah, Amnesia, another plot device. Hmm. Wonder why Locke uh, cares so much about girls losing their memories. We'll find out later. Well, anyways... And we talked to this guy, he'll let us in the uh, training center here. Or the adventuring school, whatever. 
and if you take a sip of that it'll restore all your HP and MP and what does this guy have to say get move and we get a monster in a box oh no I'm so scared yeah we got a potion from that nothing too special yeah tells you about relics go over those more later on when I actually get more of them alright we need an ether in that pot that restores uh, 50 magic points not too shabby and yeah there's a whole bunch of battle tactics you can talk to all these guys to find out uh, stuff about the game as far as like you know stuff you could use like uh, you know using the back row uh, magic effects stuff like that nothing I really need though battle tactics yeah about the same stuff alright we get a potion and not, nothing in that pot I was thinking there might have been ether but not that time Alright, I'm going to take a pause break now and be right back. Alright, we're back. And we still get the same music in the overworld? No, that won't last forever. I promise you that. And the encounter rate has... almost completely died. Yeah, and I don't think these guys can absorb fire, but you can give it a shot here. It doesn't kill them, but it gives me one more round to try and steal, I guess. Didn't work. Oh well. Shouldn't matter after this battle anyways. Halt! Oh. None shall pass. Well, except you guys. Go and speak to the king. Okay, well that guy over there says the same exact thing that he does, so... Yeah, let's go talk to the king. I'm gonna skip those areas for now. I'll come back to them later. Okay, you got a new character here, Edgar. He is a uh, master of machinery. He likes to use, uh, well, machines as weapons, like machine guns, drills, stuff like that. Good shit. And he's a ladies' man. No, actually, I, I think he likes you for your face, actually. <laughs> OK. 
Okay, apparently Terra doesn't... Forgot about the whole puberty thing. She's probably in mind control all those years, so she probably doesn't really know what the hell it means anyways. Oh well. Alright, in that chest we get a gold needle. And yeah, here we can buy a whole bunch of items that I don't care about right now, so I'm going to skip that. And this guy right here, he sells tools. I'm actually going to get a noise blaster here, cast confuse on all enemies, and a bio blaster. Same thing I was using with the uh, Magitech armor there. So yeah, that, that'll that definitely be useful. And we get a potion and antidote, and I'm going to take a pause break now and be right back. Okay, and we're back. And... Yeah, there's some treasure I want to get up in this part of the castle here. Alright, we get a phoenix down. Much better than a phoenix down. Anybody who's played the Super Nintendo version that uh, Ted Woolsey translated knows what I'm talking about when I'm talking about a phoenix down. <laughs> yeah. Good job, Woolsey. He couldn't just call it a... I mean, he was trying to abbreviate it, obviously, but he couldn't have just called it a life potion. I mean, come on. Seriously? Oh, okay. Yeah, and if you go up that door, that leads to, like, a free in, but I'm not going to use it because I don't need to right now. And, obviously, this is Figaro the Desert Castle, if I didn't mention that before. Well, let's talk to this lady. Edgar has a twin brother, huh? I guess this guy is, uh, his name is Sabin, he's Edgar's brother. Okay, well, I'm going to take another pause break and be right back. Okay, we're back, and... <laughs> Apparently he likes hitting on uh, little little kids too. What a guy. Hmm. Apparently the southern continent has been overrun by the Empire, huh? Alright. But uh, yeah, actually there's not much to say other and the next area or the next part of the game I'm actually going to be, uh, well there's going to be an event coming up. So uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and stop the video right here. Uh, that's all for this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. This is Veteran0121. See you next time.